marking the middle string of each unison. So I'm laying out the Trinoplex and on this Kanabi. So how I start is I use this tool and I have a V notch right here that centers itself on the capo bar. And then I mark 53 right to here. And then 10 millimeters is what I want the top. And I put it on the capo and then I get this spacing right here from the front pins to the rear pins. Then what I do is I get this rear pin and I just do a pencil line all the way across the top section. Then I make my divisions. So this is the 10 millimeters and I am doing, let's see, uh, four, four notes on this one. That's because of the top two section there's 42 notes and so uh, from 10 and then the original spacing from the front to rear pin was 20 millimeters So I got to work my way Making these little little longer on each one to get to uh, back to the normal position So these will be 10 millimeters. This will be 11 This will be 12 and I measure from this back line that I created and then on the second section I am going with a uh, center line this is the 18 millimeter section, so obviously I'll go nine millimeters back this way, nine millimeters that way, and I'll be doing that on each section, working my way to the normal width of 20. Next is drawing the line. This is the artsy part. center line and see this is 16 so that'll be 8 each way Five, six, seven, eight. Seven, eight. All right so the Chernoplex is completely laid out uh, the top spacing here is 10 millimeter and it progressively gets larger until it gets to the 20 millimeter.
chisel for helping with the notching, doing the side of the notch. I found this piece of steel at a uh, antique shop and it was to like a butchering tool or something like that and I converted it into a bridge notching tool. So, works fantastic, I love it. Bridges are all notched and uh, here's the final result. I, uh, what I didn't say on an earlier video, uh, the epoxy coating, is that I satinized the epoxy. So what that is, I sanded with a 320 and then finished off with some steel wool and wax and polished it up to a satin sheen. And so that with the bridge notching, you know, the hickory, it just comes out really beautiful. I just love the hickory. The multicolor just adds a beauty to it. Look at that. Really beautiful. And so here's the uh, Trinoplex layout, all finished, and that's how it looks. Notice that it's back away from the front. And it starts out narrow, and it gets wider and wider and wider till about here it gets to the width that it was originally so there you go so we'll see you in the next video thank you for watching